In recent years, our YouTube video reports have mainly focused on rife agricultural contractors working during spring. But in this video, we'll check out their work during the autumn harvest. Plus, you'll get a first look at some of Rife's new machines, which you'll see more of in 2022. Rife Agricultural Contractors is located in the north of Luxembourg. The company has a spectacular fleet of vehicles that serves farmers in the region as well as municipal and commercial customers. Over the last 10 years, Farmworld TV has followed the development of these contractors very closely with DVDs, video streaming of feature-length films and with shorter videos here on our YouTube channel. Rife Agricultural Contractors has its roots in their own agricultural and forestry business. Over the years, their main focus has shifted from livestock to arable farming, and they decided to establish a contracting business. Rife grow potatoes on 140 hectares and market their entire crop within the region. Due to the region's altitude, the potato harvest only starts in August with new potatoes and then runs until November. In the past, the business mainly produced propagation stock. But Reif has been working closely with Mark Nikolai, an agricultural and processing company which produces regional chips and crisps since 2015. On the day of our visit, one of the potato harvesters being used has been provided by Mark Nikolai's. Rife also has its own harvester on site. There are at least three people standing at the sorting table on top of the harvester to sort out stones, clods of earth, potato weed and rotten potatoes on the spot. It is essential that the potatoes are handled carefully so that customers, whether industrial customers or consumers, can be supplied with premium produce. The two double-row Grimmer potato harvesters are more or less identical in design. Reif bought the SE 260 in 2020. Its hopper has a capacity of 6 tonnes. With the yields of 50 to 70 tonnes per hectare, depending on the crop variety, it doesn't take long before a large volume has been harvested and needs to be moved off the field. As the maize harvest takes place at the same time, the contractor's fleet is under maximum strain during autumn. That's why even older tractors like this 411 Vario are deployed in the fields. This machine is the only one from the 400 series used by Rife. They bought this tractor in 2001 and it's already clocked up more than 12,000 operating hours. The Favorite 816 is also part of the contractor's older lineup. Bought by senior partner Josie Reif in 1994, this tractor has more than 20,000 operating hours under its belt. Along with the two 824 Favorite machines, it's one of three tractors from the Angular 800 series in the Reif fleet. By the way, there's a limited edition special miniature of this model available in the fan shop. After 27 years of service, today will be one of the last real working days for the Favorite 816. Soon, this tractor will be permanently retired to the Rife Agricultural Machinery Museum, which is currently in the planning stage. Tours of the agricultural contractor's site are already offered on a regular basis though, and can be requested via their website. Once the potatoes have been delivered to the Sinplants Production Cooperative, they're sorted and some of the crop is put into storage. In Luxembourg, a few dozen farmers grow around 650 hectares of potatoes. A large part of the harvest is prepared for further use in this plant.
We're going to stick to root crops though and take a look at the beet harvest next. The Rife arable farm grows 20 hectares of sugar beets in its crop rotation. Their beet harvester is mainly put to use for customers rather than on their own farm. Jeff Rife, the company's managing director, occasionally gets to sit behind the wheel of this 590 horsepower harvester himself when the business is short on staff. When it was time to replace some of the trailed harvesting machines in the fleet around 10 years ago, investing in this self-propelled harvester was a gamble for the business. On the one hand, they wanted to continue to serve their customers, who at the time had about 70 hectares to be harvested. And on the other hand, they wanted to gain more customers by offering them a powerful harvesting machine. Efforts to bring more variety into crop rotations have also resulted in more and more regional farmers going back to beets. These days, rife agricultural contractors harvest around 200 hectares of beets for their customers. They have achieved their goal of attracting customers with enough acreage to make their self-propelled machine a worthwhile investment. What's more, they've helped sugar beets to make a minor comeback in the region. Some customers also contract Rife to clean the harvested beets. This compact machine has a throughput of 80 to 110 tonnes per hour. Many livestock farmers in the region add beets to their silage in the form of beet pulp. For Rife agricultural contractors, the maize harvest is the last main campaign of the year. In autumn 2021, they harvested around 4,000 hectares in just a few weeks. During the maize harvest, they employ 65 permanent members of staff, plus 25 temporary workers in the various different departments of the company. At times, they had a total of eight forage harvesters from their own fleet, and a Jaguar 970 demonstration machine out in the fields during the harvest. The new Orbis maze header with integrated running gear and a smart safety folding mechanism was deployed for the first time in 2021. At this time of the year, they usually have around 50 tractors in the fields for their customers, mainly for the maize harvest. Thanks to abundant rainfall, and the late ripening of the maize plants, the average yield of 40 to 45 tonnes was significantly exceeded in 2021. Rife really stepped up for its customers to prevent frost and wind damage in late October. The 2021 harvesting campaign challenged the Rife team to the maximum. For the 2022 season, their fleet of forage harvesters will be extensively modernised. The company has ordered two more 950 machines, plus an 884 horsepower Jaguar 980. The oldest Jaguar, an 890 Speedstar, built in 2007, which we filmed here during a forage harvest, will be transferred to a farm in Luxembourg. We'll showcase Rife's numerous new acquisitions separately in an overview of their new machines for the 2022 season. There'll be a lot to cover, as not only did Rife order new forage harvesters, but they also ordered three Vedestan tempos, three round baler wrapper combinations from Kroner and Fent, new swathers, a timber trailer for forestry work, a track excavator, and several tractors. We're also planning on adding to the second part of the video series on J. Rife Fent Classics. Our footage of numerous tractors built between 1959 and 1968 from Rife's own Fent collection is already in the can. J. Rife Fent Classics Part 2 will be available on DVD and as a 4K on demand video. For more information about Rife Agricultural Contractors, please visit the website and fan shop and follow the company on Facebook 
and Instagram.